Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If it's your first time here, my name is Mutawini and don't forget to click that subscribe button because here I give you the best from my experience guys. So you are guaranteed that it's going to work. So guys, today I'm going to be working on my sister's hair. I'm going to be styling her hair and I thought it's good I share with you this style guys. So what I'm first starting is by detangling her hair. The first thing that you want to you have to do is spray the hair with water. Make sure that the hair is wet before you go ahead and start detangling your hair because you can't actually go in with two styling without first detangling the hair. I'm a fan of doing finger detangling. I don't like using too much of combs on my hair. Yeah, because my goal is to grow my hair and Finger detangling gives you that room because you don't over manipulate your hair when you're doing finger detangling, guys. I've done a video on finger detangling, so if you've not yet checked it out, check it out, guys. It's actually going to help you if you're trying to grow your hair long, guys. Yeah, so first I'm going to detangle her hair, then after that we'll get into the styling process. By the way guys, if you're trying to go natural or you've just started doing your natural hair and you don't know much about it, first it's good to understand that you don't need to comb your hair like all the time guys. You just need to comb your hair when you're styling it and when you're washing your hair. And also it's good to always avoid too much of usage of combs yeah, because they are not so much friendly with our african hair that is type 4 type of hair guys so make sure that you minimize the amount of combs you use on your hair and also make sure that when you try when you're combing your hair it's wet guys don't comb your hair when it's dry because <clears throat> it's going to break guys So guys, I'm through with finger detangling her hair, the whole head, and this is how it looks like, guys. This can be also a wash and go style. It's so cute, guys. So you can also try it. You can, after you have applied your products, you can comb it or finger detangle it to give it this look, guys. It's so cute. I set the camera guys and I realized that it was not recording from the start of the video so that's why I'm showing you when I've already like done almost a half of her head guys so what I'm now doing is twisting her hair at the center part but when I'm through you'll be able to see the whole process guys because the sides have not done the same way i'm doing at the center of our head guys look at our hair guys it looks so moisturized and that is what i normally tell most people guys make sure that your hair is moisturized like that is number one thing that will help your hair grow make sure that your hair is always moisturized you can moisturize your hair using loc method or the lco method that is liquid oil and cream or liquid cream and oil yeah that is the two good ways to moisturize your hair guys and you need to understand that moisturizing your hair is not about putting oil on your hair or like spraying water on your hair all the time you need to use a liquid which is leave-in you can use a leave-in treatment and a oil whichever oil you would prefer then a cream sometimes 
if for the first time when i was going natural i didn't have creams so i used to do gels instead of creams and sometimes i could just do leave-in oil and leave-in and guys it actually worked for me so if you don't have all those you don't have the cream or yeah you can try something else just to make sure that your air is never dry it's always moisturized guys that is so important when you're trying to grow your hair because guys if your hair is not moisturized it start, it starts drying up and it starts drying up from the ends of your hair the tips the tips of your hair and when they get dry they like break and that's how your hair you will never notice your hair growing because it's always breaking so guys for those who are natural tell us like for how long have you been natural or what is your goal when it comes to your natural hair guys like why why did you decide to go natural and what wh what are your goals as for me guys my goals is to grow my hair long and also to work on the volume of my hair guys my hair is not that much dense so i'm always trying to work on my hair to make it to have more volume and I, i'm sure i'm going to achieve that so what i'm doing now currently is i'm um, using coconut oil and also black castor oil because i've watched some reviews on black castor oil and people say that it helps in increasing the volume like yeah of your hair so i'm hoping it will work for me and if it works for me guys i will surely share with you my results and how i did it guys so guys finally i'm through with the entire head i think it took me like two and a half hours yeah you know i'm not so much used to doing this so i'm a bit slow but i think it came out well so now we are going to be doing the final touches and that's how the hair is looking like guys so guys those hair ornaments i got them from this lady so you can just it was i think 150 bob there are others so i've just used only these three yeah they make your hair look more better guys yeah and just look at that hair guys i'm so proud of myself guys i couldn't imagine that i can actually style someone's hair and make it have this good look guys like i'm improving each day if you think that the air style is good and appealing and beautiful leave your comments below guys So guys thank you for watching remember to subscribe to my youtube channel if you've not yet subscribed guys because i'm here to help your hair grow and also so many other videos coming guys so thank you for watching remember to subscribe and bye